Okay, so today I am way out in the boonies. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get a signal out here. It looks like if we can get a signal, the only possibility are some VHF transmitters that are like 31 miles away. And I'm surrounded by mountains. And, uh, you know, even though there's a website that gives you an idea of what signals you'll get and what you won't, I find out it's not always accurate. I often use tvfool.com and uh, it is helpful. At least they know which direction to point. But when the guy lives this far out in the hills here, and I mean it's isolated. Hope that's him. If not, some stranger is not going to appreciate me videotaping him. Is that him? Can I include you in my video? I always document my antennas. If people don't want me to, I... Sure. It'll be fun. <laughs> So here he is, the gentleman I'm going to be putting the antenna up for. Now look at his old antenna up there. That thing is pretty beat up. You know what I'm thinking? I can, we can definitely improve whatever you got going there. Okay, so this is kind of funny. I was just inside the house doing a signal report on this funny looking antenna here, which he said almost touches the roof during the snow. It's a, it's a wooden stick holding it up, by the way. Uh, I'm, getting, uh, I'm getting all these channels right here. Just by auto-programming his TV, I was able to get four more channels, four or five. A lot of people don't even know about auto-programming a TV. Somebody sets up their TV for them, and they don't realize what they have to do to get the new channels to come in. Anyway, we're going to uh, we're going to try a new antenna, see how it compares. Okay, so there's the there's the finished product right there. That ended up replacing this, and it's getting far better signals. Now that wasn't really the perfect antenna for the job here, but to me the perfect antenna is the antenna that does the job and costs the least. And not only that, it's lightweight, you don't have to worry about wind, snow. This thing here had a problem with snow, so. Although, uh, this is crazy. I'm going down the road here and this car's on fire right on the side of the road. There's nobody around here. I'm gonna see if I have cell, for, cell service. Oh my goodness. Well, the fire department has been called. There ain't a whole lot I can do about this or anybody else here. But uh, had to be arson because I just drove up this road and that car was fine. I think I'm about to get kicked out. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> 